Hey gang, welcome back. This is Captain Cowboy here with another UAC video. Guys, I just touched on a new thing that I'm going to be doing. So from today, which is September 22nd, until October 10th, I'm going to be putting out a little kind of gig going out. So if anyone wants to join or subscribe to my channel. I mean, it shows me a lot of support and I really appreciate it. And I want to show my support uh, to everyone get going back and giving back to my community um, and the community of Guns of Glory. I'm gonna, I want to give a giveaway. So, we're about 400 subscribers away from hitting 2,000. Now, I don't want to just stop at 2,000, but about 90% of my viewers every single day are not subscribed. And I want to kind of, you know, change that. Um, it doesn't seem right, so I want to do a little small giveaway and show my appreciation. If we can hit 2,000 subscribers, so in the next 18 days, we gain 400 subscribers. That's about, what, 22, 24 subscribers a day. I'll give away $150 worth of gift cards to two lucky subscribers. Um, I'll go through my entire subscriber count, and I'll just do random number generator, and give away a couple um, gift cards to Apple, I, like the iTunes um, store, or to uh, Google Play card. So you can use that money and build up your account and continue playing Guns Glory and be stronger than everyone else in your kingdom. Now $150 isn't a whole lot for this game, but it's definitely going to be something in it. You know, I hope you guys would appreciate it as much as I appreciate you all. So... That's my plan, and I hope that, you know, maybe I could continue doing giveaways like that in the future. So spread the word. Everyone who subscribes between, well, since I started my YouTube account last year, um, or earlier this year, actually, to Octo um, October 10th will be eligible for this gift card giveaway. So I hope everyone can, you know, is excited for that as much as I am. But let's go ahead and get into this video. This video is awesome. So right here, you'll see we have, well, Guns of Glory. We're doing UAC, just going around killing some people. You'll see I killed a skipper. He's a pretty strong uh, City 32. I was going back and forth with him a couple times during UAC. Then there's Awesome and Dr. Death, both T10s. And I'm just, you know, speeding up, killing them, knocking them down, and going back. You know, just power hungry, want some kills. So I'm going to go get those kills. Because it's fun. And you guys enjoy watching me do that. So. It's a little annoying. I'm pretty much the only one defending for my own alliance right now. I mean, I've got some help. But these guys are just pests. I'll speed up a march to them. Or I'll even go slowly. And then... As soon as I get there, if I go slowly, it'll just walk away. So now Skipper is back here. So look, I'm chasing him out of one tower and he's back into another tower. So it's just a constant back and forth, going at it, head to head. This guy, he's got some, uh, we're in first place, so we have a lot of treasure. So he's got some stat bonuses on me. So it's honestly just going back and forth, punch for punch. It ta usually it takes me about two marches per kill to get him down, out of my towers. Um... He's got about 300% stats on me in the treasure details for the bonuses because of the amount of treasure we have. So, it's a good fight. It's 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 quite wonderful. I think he's actually a City 33. I don't know. I forgot by now. But, this guy is sending T9s. Uh, T9 artillery. Like, if you're doing UAC, please don't be doing that. That's just wrong. So... I mean, it was a pretty even setup, in my opinion. He's just got, you know, higher stats, personally, because um, of this whole thing. So, he's, he's doing well for himself. But, I'll just go ahead and I'll march him again.
So we want to, you know, switch up our temporary wonders and get a good solid march on them, if we can. And, well, it worked out. So, I mean, it, again, it takes two marches. But, um, it would have beat him. He's got a nice airship. Although, I'd prefer um, if he kept his airship at a odd level. Because you get more points out of it. But, if you know, that's a problem with financials. Or just, you know, where you end with your available experience. That's fine. It's not a huge deal. But you can end on a odd level. So, we're out here, we're in first place, we're having some fun, but let's go invade. I mean, I think that'd be pretty nice. Um, go have a little more fun than just chasing them. chasing them around out of my tower so let's go ahead and you know see what we can do Got our next march coming up. <laughs> and we're going back for Skipper. So, I'm going to take my time with this. I don't need to waste my gold. I know he's not going to run away. He's just going to take it like a man. You know, just take it right up the back entrance door. You know how it goes. We're going to hand him some pancake mix. You know, maybe some chocolate chips. Maybe a little bit of syrup too. Just like a little pour it in there. Um... He's going to win that first march, as usual. I mean, this is how it goes now with his stat bonuses. Um, but, you know, all I can say is I should increase my stats more. Now, if you look at there, this is what I don't like dealing with. That little C-26 is sending one artillery to my tower. Why do I want to waste three minutes of a march to kill one troop? You know, I, I would just wish that my alliance would be there to help me out with that. Um, they usually do a really nice job with that, and I appreci appreciate that about them. But I want more. I want more from life, you know? Just like how I want more death from Skipper. So we're going to get it. I mean, that one hurt a little bit, but <laughs> it hurt more for him. Slightly. Not much, though. So he's got some infantry coming back, and that's about it. His airship can't die, sadly. I might just have to, like, train my distance troops and, like, teach them how to shoot at blimps in the sky, just like the Hindenburg. Just watch that little boy come flying down. Flamins everywhere. Yeah. The English language is so difficult, let me tell you. But, you know, we shall triumph. So, I think someone actually was able to help me with that C-26. But, 
most of my guys, they did a fantastic, fantastic job going out there, getting into these guys' kingdoms, and taking everything they have. So let's go ahead and see if we can, you know, give this guy a run for his money. Um, he's trying to take over my tower, so I'll try to take over his heart. But I think this guy's a little smarter, just a little, than, you know, a typical C30 is. So he's actually going to turn around his march and just not worry about it. Ooh, that one hurt. <laughs> I guess I forgot to have my uh, temporary wonder. Or troops, <laughs> 177 million troops healed, or 17 million, then 82 million. Oh, and then he hit me again. That one was much better. <laughs> Finally had some troops home to be able to take that, rather than just having 600k T1s die. So, that was nice. I should most likely get a temporary wonder for my airship abilities. He got a nice attack on me. That was a good one. That was a nice try. Well, they're definitely teaming up. So, I can tell they're teaming up. You know, they're sitting next to each other and they're not attacking each other. So, he wants to attack me, that's fine. I'll kill his buddy that's sitting next to him. Just watch it burn. Not even lose a million power. Oh my god. I lost 20k for that. That I mean, it's just not worth my time, at, honestly, at that point. But I'm notorious for just not healing my troops. So, got some burnings going around. I'm just living life, you know? I'm trying to find the next victim. Now, I don't understand. There's just like a little glitch going out there. Keeps telling me that Awesome wants to die yet again. But instead, it's actually telling me that Dr. Death is going to face his death. So, let's let him see it. Or will he pull his troops away? No. He just takes it. He knows it. He knows how to do it. So it looks like they keep speeding some troops on me. That was cute. I mean, that almost hurt. Oh, he's actually got better stats than me. I'm actually surprised. I don't know if um, you get any stat bonuses on your castle. But... Oh no, never mind. That's because I don't have my airship abilities at home because my airship was out attacking. So, maybe after like the 5th March, I might learn my mistakes that I made here, but most likely I won't. So, let's just keep playing, keep having some fun. And uh if I ever decide to attack Doc Death, we'll see how this goes. Have some fun with it. Probably just waiting on my troops to return. That's my best bet. Yeah, so he's got about he's got a lot of power. I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna give it a shot. I think we will now that he's got troops coming out. It'll make it a little easier on me to kill him. So we'll probably have his airship out in this march. So that's my best bet. So we can, you know, try to do, see what we can do. I'm, I'm like debating. I'm like, okay, well, I really want to keep him out of my towers. But at the same time, I really want to kill him at home. So I'm thinking, well, can I do both? <laughs> the short answer is yes, you can. And I will.
and I'm just like, okay, Skipper gonna attack again? I don't know. Honestly, I have no idea. How much does he hate me? And I think he's like, alright, this guy, <laughs> I don't want to deal with him anymore. <laughs> so, he's pulling back. And then, I mean, this is fun. This is more enjoyable than KVK, in my opinion. KVK just, you know, going back and forth, just waiting around. But, I mean, it's uh, it's something, all right. KVK, I mean, it's that's the end game for all the bigs. Like, UAC is fun and all, but it's honestly just a gold pit. Like, I, I spend maybe 150k gold at least per UAC, and I hardly even play UAC. I honestly just log in. Oh, I have to defend again. Defend, and then I'm done. I'll make a video of it, post it online on YouTube for all of you guys, and then that's about it. So, now let's, you know, try some more marching. Oh, he pulled a quick one on me. I guess he decided to rally someone. So, yeah, that's what I deal with in this kingdom a lot. Everyone in my kingdom just wants to protect their troops from me, and I don't get it. I don't appreciate it, is what I don't do. I don't appreciate it. Skipper's out here, wants me to kill him again, so I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to do it. I'm going to have to give you what you want. I'm a, I'm a lady pleaser. What can I say? I'm a people pleaser, I should say. Is that more PC for you all? I don't know, but it's going to take me to attack, so we'll see. So, gang, everyone here watching, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Get in on this uh, giveaway. I hope you guys enjoyed this little clip.